you know, I keep thinking that somewhere out there, there's going to be some followers, maybe just a follower, who will wake up from their delusion. As things like this continue to happen so often here in the end times, if you guys know who this is, Joshua Holmes, uh, here's the headline, Texas prophet, whom followers call Jesus in the flesh, uh, shown in a sex tape with multiple women. Surprise, surprise, right? Absolutely amazing. Very charismatic, dressed to the T, Joshua Holmes caught in a sex tape. Let's go to scripture. 2 Thessalonians chapter 2. Man, I pray that if you're caught up with this guy, that you will wake up in the name of Jesus Christ. Let's start in verse 10. And with all deceivableness of unrighteousness in them that perish, because they received not the love of the truth, that they might be saved. A couple of things here. This, of course, is talking about the lawless one coming. But it's applicable to you in these end times. And quite frankly, very wide open for those that would discern. If you don't love the truth, chances are you're going to be sent a strong delusion. Verse 11, and for this cause, God shall send them strong delusion that they should believe a lie. In this case, with Joshua Holmes, uh, he primarily targets females who swoon over him. He's a biblical novice at best, using the Holy Scripture again for personal gain. Filthy lucre, and of course, now we find out in this case, sex. Let's read a little bit about this. Self-styled Texas prophet and internet preacher, uh, preacher Joshua Holmes, who went viral in recent months for his ministry theatrics, and believe me, they are theatrics, that led many of his female followers to start calling him Jesus in the flesh. Oh my, wow, this is delusion has been captured in leaked video recordings indulging in explicit sexual activity with two women, I love this part, who are not his wife. Astonishing, absolutely astonishing. Down here, Holmes, a flamboyant young minister who many critics have dismissed as a dangerous departure from Orthodox Christianity, has been defended by, by his followers, and why wouldn't they defend him? They're in delusion. As Jesus in the flesh, as he professes healings, and of course... Ready, money, miracles. It's always all about the money. It's absolutely astonishing. Young woman said about him, for all you haters, if you don't know Prophet, I love how they call him Prophet, Joshua Holmes, you ain't got the Holy Spirit. That's all I got to say, a young woman noted in a viral video on Facebook. And they do, they come out in droves defending these types of preachers. So why am I putting this out there? in the hopes that someone will please wake up. This man is not of God. He's a horrifying person. Uh, in fact, if you read Matthew 23, this type of person will actually receive the greater damnation because he chooses not to enter in uh, the door of salvation. And he, in fact, blocks his flock from entering also, putting them into delusion of the strongest type. And we know what kind of lifestyle this guy is leading now. Here's the evidence. Let's read a little bit more. Holmes was also featured on the World Network Greg Davis Live show last fall and declared that the Lord had been leading him to focus on wealth in the body of Christ, of course, right? Nothing about salvation. It's about, like Joel Olstein says, living your best life now. Last month, he was a featured guest of Bishop George Bloomer on the network where he delivered a vague prophecy about what 2019 would look like. Former members of Holmes Block, like Yassir Wright, however, have stated on social media that the preacher is a fraud and accused him prior to the release of these videos of sleeping with several women in his church, even though he is a married father. Absolutely tragic. So we want to, I wanted to do this short video to expose this fraud. And if you've been duped by this person, understand there is a real Jesus Christ who loves you and who wants to save you, what's the catch? Well, actually, there's no catch. I'm not trying to put it like that, other than to abide in the truth, to love the truth of Jesus Christ. And just know that if you don't love the truth of Jesus Christ, if your mission is only to get satisfied in the wealth category, or in this case, to somehow uh, throw yourself, because if you've watched these videos of this guy, there are 
many scantily dressed women, oh, it's very disturbing to watch themselves throw them, or to watch them throw themselves at Joshua Holmes. Very sexual, very disturbing. Uh, that's not what the gospel is. It's not what the gospel is. Seek the kingdom of God first, and all these things will be added to you. The things that God wants you to have, not what the world wants you to have. Joshua Holmes is an absolute fraud. Uh, avoid him at all costs. If you know anybody that's caught up, pray for them. Pray that they would come away from this very, very evil man.